I thought there was a great representation of Temple fans today. I thought that was terrific. I think that helped us. I really do. We haven't been focused on doing the little things to help each other out. I felt like today we were determined to try to do those extra things. Again, the score might not show it, but we all as a group know what we were able to get done. You have to admire Temple, you know, the way they started the game and, and how they, they, uh, uh, they competed until they couldn't. Well, I thought there were some really good players early on, and I thought Shiz made some tough shots for us. I thought uh, Nate gave us some good energy in the first half, a couple of good runouts, and so I th we just we just did our thing tonight, and I was proud of the guys. We felt like we had a poor performance versus Cincinnati, and we wanted to show people that we you know we're a good team, also. So we just needed to get that that win back. <laughs> got to win games at this point in time you got to win games and we're grateful for our run here but there's no assurances that it continues unless we do a really good job on both ends of the floor and practice well and understand what our jobs are arena um, a lot of great wins a lot of just memories that I'll never forget so Our teammates wanted to wanted to win for us, even though the outcome didn't come out how we wanted it. I feel like we we still all stuck together. You know, after Tanea made the shot, you seen all the positive energy, and I think that just you can't ask for nothing more than that. 
excited to be moving on. Uh, I thought Tulane gave us uh, a great effort. I thought our maybe the difference in the game was the amount of times that we got to the foul line. We I thought we drove it, drove it well. We we pressed the issue a little bit. We talked about it, but obviously it opened up for us a little bit tonight. So big shots were made. Obi made some big shots. Um, J.P. Mormon made a big shot. Shiz Alston made some big shots, a couple big foul shots down the stretch. So, uh, And then the last piece would be just turning it over six times, which I think is something we take a lot of pride in, but it doesn't always happen that way. But we're, we're thrilled to be moving on. This is kind of like a transition year for you, going from an underclassman playing the tournament to an upperclassman leadership role. How have you adjusted to that new position? Uh, a lot because I know you know I only have one more year left and every game counts for me so you know I'm just trying to lead the guys and let them know how important it is we want to get to the NCAA tournament so just let them know how important that is. Um, you know being a freshman doesn't matter to me I've been playing basketball my whole life so you know making big shots and, and taking big shots is nothing new to me. Uh, played really competitively in high school so you know it just translates over. Uh, coach doesn't like when we turn the ball over so the less times we have the more chance we can win so it was good. <laughs> what was it like? Tremendous respect for Coach Fran Dunphy and his kids and the, the, how hard they play. They're hard to guard. Thank goodness we made enough shots and plays um, to, to win the game. Well, we had three real good games against Wichita State. I thought uh, we played well in each of them. I think they are a really good basketball team. They're a really good basketball program. A lot of veteran guys out there. They made some veteran plays at the right time. I thought our guys did a really good job. I'm proud of them. Proud of how hard they played. Proud of the fact there was no, no give up in them. You were guarding Shamet, and and you were on him tightly. He was just he was making shots. How about? Uh, well, we we, we kind of did a good job the first two times playing him, keeping him under control. But he's a good player, man. Uh, he, he saw a big basket early, and uh, he got that team going. And he hit a lot of you know tough shots. The one at the end of the half was really big. So um, uh, kudos to him. My hat goes out to him. Uh, they're hard to guard. They're good players. Uh, Shaman got hot early, and uh, Shaq is a beast down low. But, you know, we, we should have denied Shaman early so he couldn't get that uh, hot start. But, you know, they're good players, so it was tough to, you know, match up against them. I think, you know, anytime the season ends, you just want to keep playing basketball. And for them, um, for the whole team, you know, I'd be happy to play in, in any tournament that we can get in, uh, just to keep playing and, and keep um, being a part of this group. We just want to play another game. That's all. We just want to not stop playing. And I want that for these guys, especially for not these two, right? I want the, for them too, but more for our seniors who have had great careers and done, done great work for Temple. And if we can keep on playing, that'll be great.